this is never to get with Disket. Bringing to you season seven of cooking on the Disket. Season seven is brought to you by Crazy Good LLC, a distribution company of sauces, rubs, and all kinds of good stuff. We're going to show you something very, very special and unique today. So don't you dare go away. Welcome back. Now, today we're showcasing the very first episode of 2013. Got a lot of them out there, got a lot more great episodes to come. Today's gonna be very special because we're gonna share an exclusive offer with you guys. And to bring that to us is Phil. Now, Phil, was Phil's gourmet sauce been here before? Hey, Nevin, how you doing? Good, welcome back. Thank you. <laughs> we got Phil's disc in here that has his logo uh, uh, kind of put into this thing, and you're gonna cook something for us today? Yeah, I got an open faced uh, pomegranate barbecue turkey. Sandwich. Open face barbecue, pomegranate barbecue, uh, turkey you sandwich. You get all that. Like. <laughs> now we got some sauteed mushrooms with that and uh, sauteed uh, onions. Nice. This is going to be great. Nice. And what we're doing here is we're doing the turkey in conjunction with the release of the turkey disc for the National Wild Turkey Federation. And we'll talk a little bit about that here um, as we go through the episode. Now, you cannot buy that from us. This is an exclusive offer that you can get only from the banquets throughout the country of the National Wild Turkey Federation. But let's get into this. Got some uh, turkey open face. What do you got, breast yeah. thighs? Yeah, I have some uh, turkey breasts and some turkey thigh. Just mixing that dark meat and that light mm, meat. It's going nice. to be really good. Got a lot of taste in that dark meat. So Cool. So you already got the disket on? Got the disket going here. Cheater. Yeah. <laughs> You say five seconds. <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh, we're just going to saute some uh, onions here, get them caramelized. This is what's going to be topped off on your your sandwich there. So we're going to cook that for a while. Get this going. Oh, you got some of the mushrooms already uh, in there. Huh? Yeah, on that too? we're getting a little head start. <laughs> Oh, so. now, how many times have you done this dish before? How many times have I done this dish? Probably about twice now. Nice. Yeah. Come up pretty good, I'm sure. Oh, uh, no. I've been, <laughs> I've been doing that for a while. So you're going to love it. Man, it's going to be so Get good. Get these nice and caramelized. Now, what kind? Did you use regular oil or what did you put in yeah, there? Yeah, I put a little olive oil. Olive oil. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just, mm -hmm. You want to just layer that flavor in there. Those look so good. Yeah. I they're, love they're onions. They're going to be great. I love onions. You know, I love pepper. <laughs> you love pepper. Yeah, it so love happens pepper. I have some pepper. What is this? That's pepper. Give it a try. What the? No, just hold it up. What did it do? What? There you go. Oh, oh check look it out. at it's that. It's automatic pepper grinder. <laughs> All oh, day long. Here we go. You know, I like pepper. <laughs> <laughs> that go. is cool. Yeah. I'm going to steal that from you. Okay. <laughs> I'll take a biscuit for it. There you go. This is going to of a pepper grinder. Yeah, it is. <laughs> well, we're caramelizing these onions. Let's go ahead and take a second and we're going to feature this week's Spotlight Disket. This week's Spotlight Disket is the National Wild Turkey Federation Disket. And guess what? You cannot buy it from us. This is an exclusive offer. The only way that you can buy one of these diskets is by going to a local NWTF banquet. Where to find out? You can go to the nwtf.org and you can look for banquet locations. Make sure you show up to that banquet. You can go ahead and look at purchasing one of these discs. Now, if you look at it, the handles have, have the NWTF abbreviation on, which stands for National Wild Turkey Federation. The legs of the disc have the walking turkeys going up on all four different legs. So again, you cannot find this on the disc website. You can only get it at the National Wild Turkey Federation Banquet. Now there's only one per banquet and they're all over the country. So you can choose from one of 2,000, but you gotta be at the banquet to get it. So get out there, get to that banquet and support the National Wild Turkey Federation. So now we just got the opportunity to see this week's Spotlight Disket, which is the National Wild Turkey Federation design, exclusive only at the banquets. Back into here, feel those onions are smelling yeah, amazing. Yeah, they're, they're done now. I think they're caramelized. They're looking great look at here. Nice color. Look nice at that. Okay. Look, look at that. Look at that. Huh? Oh. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What we're going to do, we're just going to pull these oh, off. man. Pretty good. Mm. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're going to mm. just pull these off. We're going to get these mushrooms going. We're going to toast some bread on the side there while the mushrooms are going. Oh, so good. Yeah, they're great, aren't they? <laughs> and that only took, what, four or five minutes? Yeah, that's out? it. And then okay, you got... we're going to get, get a little bit more olive oil in there. How come you like using olive oil? Olive oil? Uh, Just saturated fats. Yeah. You got to watch out. Invest in that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're just going to saute oh, these mushrooms, mushrooms now. 
And that'll probably go pretty quick. Shrooms, oh, mushrooms will go mushrooms pretty Mushrooms will go really fast. Don't you die in those onions. Yeah. Rather distract you again, eat some more of those things. Maybe just a little bit more <laughs> olive oil in there. And we're what on? We're still on pretty much low heat. Yeah, we, you don't want to get too high up there. Yeah. So we'll just saute these off, get so them you, nice golden brown. So you're going to put the mushrooms and the onions over the turkey? Over the turkey. Nice. You're going to love it. Nice. Of course I'm going to love it. Okay. <laughs> so what we're going to do now, we're just going to get some bread. Ooh. You know what, good bread for this. Cut? Yeah, it's a French cut, kind of a rustic nice. bread. You're going to love it. Nice crust. Get a nice Throwing crust on, on it. <laughs> yeah, you're going to love it. And those ought to toast pretty quick, too, I imagine, right? Yeah, we're going to put some, again, a little bit more olive oil on these nice. as well. <laughs> Ooh, and, right and, on top of the bread. And good for you, too. Yeah, it is. Lots of it. Of course, I'm going to eat it all. <laughs> yeah, I bet. <laughs> Well, that's gonna take um, this what two minutes? Oh, uh, I, never mind. He's got pepper. I got pepper. Can you help me out? I'm a, I'm a, you know, I don't really care for pepper all that much. This is so cool. A little bit on the mushrooms in there. Anybody want to send me a Christmas present? Automatic pepper grinder. You'll love. Gotta it. have one of these, or maybe two of them, both hands. Maybe two. You know how much I like pepper. <laughs> We're gonna let that set up. We're gonna well, take a quick section, a quick mini here. We're gonna get into this week's Ask Nevin Anything section of this episode. So this week we're going to answer a few questions that kept coming in. Now we released the disc and utensil set just a couple weeks ago. We've got to answer these questions coming in about the engraving. Yes, we can engrave your name, your company name, your favorite saying, Happy Father's Day, I love you, whatever you want, onto the uh, wooden cover of the utensil box. And the same thing for the handles. So if you want to put your first name or last name or company name, whatever you want, just send us the artwork or send us the, a, a quick message of what you want to say on that. We can go ahead and get that thing programmed. So to answer all those questions that come in after the release of the utensils, just send us whatever you want on there and we'll go ahead and incorporate the pictures or names or whatever you want on the utensil set. So thanks for those questions. Keep them coming. We love answering them. So now we got a chance to answer this week's question. We're going to go back here to Phil's. Awesome, awesome. You got the mushrooms in here. Yeah, I got look the, at that bread. Look at that bread. Nice and toasty. These mushrooms, yeah, they just took a few minutes. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> got the olive oil gonna, on there. Oh, yeah, you're going to love those. I'm going to pull these mushrooms on. They're look perfect now. Yeah, they are. What's that over there? Huh? No, you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Mm. How are they? Mm. Got enough wow. pepper on those for you? Oh, man, yeah. Well, you know me and pepper. You know what? I'm going to need a spoon here. Wow. Here, let me help you out here. And uh -huh. I promise I won't take it all. Okay. Here, I'll just, there we go. Okay. And, we can and go then ahead we're going to hook up the, we can pull the turkey this, next, huh? Yeah. We'll get this bread off. I think it's about done. Man, this stuff this sounds so good. They're going to probably start calling the fire department. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Man, this looks amazing. Let me give it a good shot. Look at that. That bread is toasted. Oh, so wait till you, wait till awesome. you get that turkey in there. And so, would you say, what'd you call an open faced? It's an open faced uh, turkey sandwich. That's nice. And that turkey must put, cook pretty quick. Yeah, it does. Look for, we're going to use that pomegranate barbecue sauce Ooh, with that. Oh, really? Yeah. You can just set it down there. Let's set this here. You want me to like, put it on the opposite side of me so I don't keep eating it? Yeah, probably so. <laughs> <laughs> get a little more oil in there. You don't use very much. What is that, two no. tablespoons maybe? Yeah, probably a couple tablespoons. Look at that. Now, you got white and dark meat here. White and dark meat, And you yeah. just cubed it up? Just cubed it up. Actually kind of shaved it, got it kind of thin there. Try yeah. to cook real quick. Yeah. And do you have anything on there? Salt, pepper, no, garlic? No, not yet. yet. All we're going to add is a little bit of salt and pepper to that. We've got plenty of flavoring in the, uh, looking oh at God. that pepper. You saw me at the pepper? Huh? Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. There we go. Brown, first thing, All pepper. day long. <laughs> you know me and my pepper. Wow, that's cooking quick. Yeah, you might it. even need to put a little bit more oil, huh? I think so. Sure thing. Just a little more. And some more pepper? That <laughs> ought to do it. And we're going to use the pomegranate. Yeah, we'll use the pomegranate. We'll get a little salt on there. Man, this is so good. Now, Phil's got, what do you got? Four sauces now? Yeah, I got four sauces. I got uh, my honey apple, honey apple hot, traditional pomegranate, mm. and my chipotle. The chipotle. And you know what I have? I still haven't tried your hot honey apple. No, we'll, we'll, have, to, we'll have to get you some. Oh, man. How's that? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, okay. mm. Dump a little of that in there early. I know I'm cheating there. No, I'm to mess good. it up. That's all good. <laughs> yeah, that's good stuff. This thing cooks so quick, too. Yeah. What do you got? Three, four, five minutes left, maybe? 
Probably so, yeah. Just a few more minutes, this will be done. We'll dump that sauce in there and just let it simmer for a while. Well, well, that's cooking up real quick. Let's go ahead and jump into this week's featured local business. Hi there, I'm Phil Apodaca with Phil's Gourmet Sauces, and I use a lot of local ingredients here, you know, the chilies, the honeys, uh, and just some other local ingredients that I really, really like here. Um, I have a traditional, a pomegranate, a honey apple, and a honey apple hot that I have currently in production, and soon I'll have the uh, chipotle barbecue sauce. And let me tell you a few things that, that I like my sauce on. The traditional, I like it on brisket. The, Honey apple is excellent on uh, spare ribs, your pork spare ribs, and uh, your pomegranate, any of your pork products, whether it's chops uh, or spare ribs, e even wings. Th those are some of my favorite recipes where I have, or that I like to put my sauce on. Right now I'm locally available in uh, Keller's, uh, Triangle Grocery Store, and then uh, some Tony's Food Markets up in Colorado. There's four stores up there. Hopefully here pretty soon I'll be in uh, Whole Foods. I'm just waiting to get the high fructose corn syrup out. And as soon as I do that, I'll be in the local Whole Foods stores. So uh, keep an eye out for Phil's Gourmet Sauces at your local grocery stores. Thank you. So now you got a chance to see this week's featured business. We're back in here, we're, we're cooking. What, you said this is uh, breast and then Yeah, it has a little bit of breast and some thigh meat in there. Nice oh, turkey yeah. dish. Uh, you got through, you started off with the onions, sauteed the onions. Sauteed onions, sauteed out, mushrooms. You hit the mushrooms, sauteed those, you put the bread, the French cut bread all the way around. Now you got this awesome turkey in there cooking up real, real quick. Man, this, now all this is uh, featuring the National Wild Turkey Federation. Again, you cannot buy this biscuit from our pattern section or any our website. To get a National Wild Turkey Federation biscuit, you gotta go to a local banquet. Go to nwtf.org. You can click on your state or any other state in the country. There's only 2,000 of them available. Um, you can, there's only one per banquet too. So make sure you get over there, support the National Wild Turkey Federation, get your awesome biscuit and make anything on that thing. Here we're doing the turkey, what'd you call it? Turkey open face sandwich there, here? A barbecue open face sandwich here. No, 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 no. The Bill's Gourmet Sauce. Pomegranate, Pomegranate barbecue, barbecue open face turkey all, sandwiches all that, yeah. with extra pepper. With extra pepper. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we did. You know, we cooked everything in there just to go over it one more time. You know, we got the mushrooms, right. we got the onions, we got the bread on the side. Now you got the turkey cooking in there. So you got all those great flavors in there. It's oh, just kind of layers, layers of flavor. We're just gonna add this sauce now, the oh, pomegranate man. barbecue sauce. Man, that looks so good. <laughs> oh yeah. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and grab the biscuit lid. Okay. I'm going to cover that up so it can just steam up right into yeah. that real Let quick. Yeah, give it a quick stir. Oh man, that smells so good. And before you know you have the Air Force flying in here, helicopters yeah. coming in I, everywhere I, just yeah. to try some of this. Won't they? <laughs> okay, there you go. Hit that thing up. So let that sit for a minute. Yeah, turn um, that down just a little bit. Cool, just adjust the temperature. Let me let me just take a look at some of your sauces real quick. All right, sure. The, um, so Phil, we've got the pomegranate barbecue sauce shown here. You got your traditional, your your honey apple, honey your apple. hot honey apple. Yeah. Um, anything else coming up new? Anything no, new well, in the future? actually, I'm going to start some rubs here. They'll probably be available for the fiery food show coming up in March. You know who 20... gets to try them first? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> your dad. <laughs> That's not right. <laughs> so Phil's gourmet sauce cooking on the biscuit. Um, that's got to be getting close to being ready to eat, man. I You're think so. Me. I think we're Should ready. Should we add more pepper? No. We're <laughs> we can go ahead and plate up some. To you. Right on. So I'm gonna pull off the the lid, it, the official biscuit lid. Oh, look at look that. Look at all that steam. Look at that pomegranate barbecue sauce on the turkey. Man, uh, look at that. Hey, look over there. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, how's that? Mmm. Yeah. No, no, you can't have any. Mm. About ready to try one? Mm. Yeah. Okay. We'll have one. We'll just get some bread here. Bam. Get some of that turkey. Oh, these, wow. these are great for, you know, when you have friends over, you got a football game going on. <laughs> you know, even if they're Bronco fans, you know, Heck you can yeah. have them there, you know. You know what it's about. Get some mushrooms on those. Oh, yeah. Don't be shy with the onions either. Okay. Wow. Better watch around Monica with us. <laughs> Look at that. You can't cook this on your grill. <laughs> so check this out. Let me show this here and zoom in on this thing. You got the bread, the turkey, you got the onions, you got the mushrooms, you Mushroom. got the pomegranate barbecue sauce by Phil's Gourmet Sauce. And the pepper. 
And the pepper. There we go. <laughs> Check this thing out. Cooking outdoors has never yeah, been better. Never been better. Mm. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Biscuits.